Today we are tasting the spaghetti in a can. They are so popular around the world and I don't understand why. So I have to do this to try to understand. Hi and welcome to Vincenzo's Plate. Today it might be the end for me. I'm eating spaghetti in a can. A while ago I was doing cooking classes for kids and a mom said to me, oh this is so lovely, kids can learn how to make fresh pasta. And I said, yeah, that's the way it should be. And she goes, oh, you know, sometimes I give them spaghetti in a can. And I said, why? When do you do that? And she goes, when we go camping. And I said, well, when you go camping, you have time to cook. Why don't you make something nice with your family instead of giving rubbish, garbage from a can? Now, let's go through the packet here. It says, Heinz, Heinz, spaghetti, the one for all. I never buy this brand. I never use anything from this brand. I can't believe this brand has been around since 1869. A tomato squeezed into every serving. Mmm, what tomato do you use? Contributes to your five plus a day. No artificial colors. No, I don't believe that. But the spaghetti are perfect for all time of the day. Break breakfast? Why would you have breakfast with spaghetti, bacon and egg? A meal for two? Sides for the family? Why do you want to give this to your family? Why? It's got three and a half health star rating. And do you believe that? Who gives this rating? Who gives this star rating? Who? If you eat this, you're not gonna live long, let me tell you. Now let's say, let's read the ingredients. Spaghetti, 53%. Water, with flour. Tomato sauce, 47%. Tomatoes, 44%. Sugar, sugar in spaghetti, come on. Salt, cheese. What cheese is it? Contains milk, food acid. What's in this? What's in this? So. This is what we need to do now. We can do the microwave, which I'm not going to do that, or cooking guide on the stove. Basically, I get a saucepan, I get, I get a saucepan like this. We're also trying uh, spaghetti from the same brand, spaghetti meatballs in a can. Spaghetti meatballs in a can. Meatballs first don't go in spaghetti. Second, the meatballs are so beautiful. Such a beautiful piece of meat. I can store meatballs in a can. The idea of eating spaghetti and meatballs from a can. This brand has been around for almost 200 years. 200 years of eating garbage. Oh my God, this is saying, listen to this. Three and a half health star rating. Great on toast. Really? Is this what you guys eat? Spaghetti, meatballs from a can and you put them on a toast? Because if that's what you do, there is no point for me to keep going to teach you recipes, Italian recipes, because you're not interested. How can you put this? This is a source of protein. So they make you believe that you eat this, you get your protein intakes. You know you don't need too much protein in your life. You just need to have a healthy life. But how can you put this on toast? I will never understand this. How can you put spaghetti and meatballs from a can on toast? This is the end of the world. Pineapple on a pizza is so much better. But you tell me, how can I teach the world how to make beautiful homemade Italian food? If this is what you want. This has been around for 200 years. Do not give this to your kids, please. But thank God the new generation, they're smarter than us. They're so smart. They know that this is bad. The parents are to blame. And if you are over 18 and you buy this, my friend, go and see a psychologist, please. Now, let's try them. We just need a saucepan. At least you can do this, a pan, to warm them up. Avoid the microwave, please. I open the can. Oh, let me smell it. It smells like a tomato in a can, but for some reason, I can smell pineapple. Is it because of my t-shirt? I don't know, I can smell pineapple. Oh, I've got some pineapple flavor in there. Okay, so this is what it looks like inside. Spaghetti, oh my god, it's so soft. 
Spaghetti is so soft, man. Oh my god, look at that. The tomato is pink. The tomato is pink. The spaghetti with tomato are pink. I don't understand what's in there. Is there ricotta in there? Why is it pink? Oh my god, look at it. It's breaking. It's breaking from my fork. Look at that. Oh my god. Okay, so we get a pan here. I can't believe I'm doing this. And we just put the spaghetti in there. Mm -hmm. This can be for the family. I think this be a size for the family. This is like half portion for me. Uh, in this pasta, I'm not gonna put any pecorino or parmigiano because they will want to escape. No cheese should touch this. No respected cheese should touch this. All right, let's put it on the stove. This is something I love about this. Empty contents into a saucepan, stir while eating gently, gently. Why do you have to be gentle to this bloody can? Why do you have to be gentle to this spaghetti from a can? I don't understand. These are not spaghetti anymore, look at that. They're all broken, they're all broken. I can't even do this. All right, here we go. I hope I'll be gentle enough. Look at this. These spaghetti are all broken, all broken. I can't even do this to eat my spaghetti, all broken, look at that, broken, broken, broken. I can give this to my dog, yes. You know what my dog is gonna say to me? Why are you giving me this, you don't love me? How can you give this to your kids? Don't you love your kids? Do I have to try this to be honest, huh? I do I have to eat this? Do you want me to eat this? Huh? After you look at this, is this do I need to eat it? Huh. I don't want to get sick. I don't want to eat this. I want you to stop to eat this. I eat it just because I love you, okay? So hopefully you will stop eating this. I'm trying to, to get the spaghetti. I just can't, I just can't get them. I have to eat them like this. Can you believe? How can I eat this spaghetti like this? But why, why do you have to offend my cuisine? Why do you have to offend my people? Huh? Why do you have to do this? Why do you have to do this to, to, to us? Hmm? I will never be able to tell this to my nonna. If I tell my nonna that we find this around the world, she will tell me to go back to Italy straight away and live with her. I was watching a documentary um, on Netflix with Zac Efron, and he goes to Italy to a town where people live so long. Like for generations and generations, people reach 100 and more than 100 years old. And they eat beautiful food, they live in a nice environment, they eat pasta almost every day, but the good stuff. This. It's not gonna make you live for a long time. It doesn't matter if you have a six pack, my friend. You can have a six pack, you can look fantastic. You can have a slim body. But if all you put inside, it's bad, you're not gonna be fine. Well, don't worry if you look good. What's inside of you is more important, okay? And this, you don't wanna put this inside of you. I'm about to do it. Do I have to do it? I'm about to do this. I'm about to put the spaghetti from a can in my mouth. You can stop me if you want. Stop me. Just write a comment and say, stop, stop, stop. Oh. Mm. Oh. Ah. Ah. I can taste flour. There is definitely something to thicken this. The spaghetti are garbage. They're so bad, so bad quality. They're so moist, they've been, they been overcooked. Oh my God, way overcooked. There's no tomato in there because these tomatoes are terrible. Where are these tomatoes from? Where are these tomatoes from? I'm gonna have one more because I need to understand what flavor it is. What flavor it is is disturbing. I don't wanna know. There's definitely this flour in there. I can't taste the cheese, there's something bitter. There's something, I feel like I'm eating a sweet. I feel like I'm eating something, a mix of a cake, uh, no pasta for sure, uh, a soup, some sort of ketchup. I don't know if this is ketchup, I don't know what it is, but this is something you definitely do not give to anyone. This is something you wanna stay away from because nobody deserves this in their life, all right? I'm gonna try the spaghetti and meatballs now, hoping it's a little bit better, but I doubt it. Okay, now we do the same thing with the spaghetti and meatballs from a can. 
Do I have to worry about cleaning the saucepan? <laughs> no way. Who cares about this? Maybe we'll give extra taste. Look at this. Look what's inside. Look at this. Look what's in. It's orange. It's an orange sauce. Look at that gelatin on top there. Look how disgusting. Guys, look how dry this is. Look how terrible. Look how disgusting. Where are the meatballs? Huh? I want to see the meatballs. Where are they? Can't be bothered cleaning the pan. I just want to see the meatballs. I want to see how they look like. Let's have a look. Come on. Oh my god. It's all stuck in this like gelatin. Let's have a look at the meatball here. Actually, they have, they have, there are meatballs in here. There are actually, there are meatballs in this. So if you look, it actually comes with meatballs. What kind of meatballs are they, huh? What's, what's inside? Oh, at first they're tough. They're tough, but what's in there? Huh? What's, what's inside? Oh, come on, guys. All right, so you really wanna eat this? Hmm? Pasta looks so dead. Looks so bad. To revive this, I need some pasta water with starch. Probably need some pecorino. But again, I'm not gonna waste a beautiful pecorino. I don't have any pasta water. Look at this. I mean, how can you eat this orange pasta with processed meatballs? Guys, I'm doing this for you. I want you to understand that this is what you're eating. And when you eat this, you need to think of me telling you do not do that. Do not do that, okay? Just buy lettuce. Eat lettuce. Eat carrots. Eat bananas. But do not eat this. If you're hungry, eat fruit. This is just sweet. There is so much sugar in there that of course you like it. Of course your kids like it. There's so much sugar in there. Who doesn't like sugar? But this is not good sugar for you. Just buy a piece of, just buy a big cake and have that. Oh my God. Oh my God. Guys, egg in here. What do we need to prove? Look at this. Lamp of spaghetti with fake meat on top. I can't even do this. How can you eat spaghetti if you can't do this? I can tell there's so much garbage in this. There's so much sugar that I, I should not eat this. This is not gonna make me happy. I'm gonna get some spa squash spaghetti with the meatball and let's see. Oh my God. Oh, it doesn't smell like anything, but the only smell I can tell is the factory food. Barrio Gusto. Ah, e basta. E basta. E don't eat this. Come on. The meatball is moist, okay? It does melt in your mouth, but what's inside? What's inside that orange tomato? Mm? The same spaghetti. How do you cook the spaghetti, guys? Make them al dente. You put them in the can, and they stay in the can for months, years. By the time that someone eats it, the spaghetti will cook. Do not cook spaghetti if they become like this. They mash it. Just make them a little bit al dente, please. Look at this. Look at this. I have to read the ingredients on this. Ingredients. Spaghetti, 45%. Tomato sauce, 43%. Tomatoes, sugar. What do you need sugar for? Huh? Ah, so you become addictive. Salt, cheese, food acid, meatball, 12%. Lamb, beef, seasoning, breadcrumbs, salt, trays of sesame, sesame. You put sesame in spaghetti and meatballs. You put soy. But where is the cheese? I can't taste the sugar. I cannot taste the cheese. How much sugar is in there, huh? Where did you get your tomatoes from? Are they coming from the moon, from Mars? Where are they? Orange tomatoes. What is this? Please guys, stay away from this, please. This deserves to go in the garbage, nothing else. They deserve to go in the garbage. That's the only place they deserve to go. Disgusting, disgusting, terrible. Ugh. I think the pen should go in the rubbish too. Ugh. Everything should go in the rubbish. Everything goes in the garbage. Guys, if you love yourself, you stay away from this. Stay away from the aisle where they sell all this stuff. Stay away, please. Eat healthy, eat fresh, cook, and enjoy. Love yourself, please. Life is precious, okay? I hope this video is gonna help you to understand that what you're doing is wrong. If some of your friends do this, stop them. Share this video with them, okay? If, if, if your kids ask you for this, say no. You don't want kids to eat this, okay? Please, watch more of my nonna's videos because nonna's 
can make you happy, okay? And nonos can give you a nice life, okay? So thank you so much for watching this episode. I will see you in the next Vincenzo's Plate video recipe. E ora si mangia. Not this for sure. Vincenzo's Plate. I've got so many recipes on my channel. Just watch them, cook them. Easy ones, medium. Most of my recipes are easy. They're for everyone. So just make them, enjoy them, okay? Thank you.